Could somebody wake me up? I don't wanna be here and let the world pass me by. Yeah. I just see your face where ever. Foot traffic has to wait another 10 minutes right here and then they'll let us go. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? As you may have gathered already, we're about to get on a ferry to uh, about Palermo, Sicily. We love train and boat travel. We've been spending all that is my O. We've been spending a lot of time on trains. So let's see how the boat works out. But isn't that expensive? Lodging and transportation for two people was just 126 euros. Oh, by the way, there's supposed to be an enormous storm right through the direction we're going. So I hope we got our seasick pills. This Christmas display at the ferry terminal left me with a certain song in my head. I'm so sick of waiting and getting too restless to be in this dusty town. I've heard of this place where people forget and you get another try. bathroom's bigger than the room. That's bigger than almost any cruise ship bathroom we've had. Well, the room's cute. Let's go check out the rest of the ship. 12 hours in our cabin is way more comfortable than 12 hours in this seat. There really is just a miniature cruise ship. Because I just want to see the light. I just wanna see the light. Bye bye, Naples. Well, it is pouring raining, but we had a wonderful night's sleep. It was comfortable. Oh, I'm not looking forward to walking in the rain. <laughs> but this was a nice ship, and I would highly recommend it. Now we're just waiting for them to release us so we can head into Palermo. As soon as they let us off the boat, we'll be in Sicily. Walk to the train station through the rain just to get here and find out there's a train strike today. Our train is here, but we'll see if it takes off. Adventure! They say it doesn't rain much in Sicily. Lucky us. We fell in love as soon as we stepped off the train in seafood. Nope. Well done, students. If you were trying to disappoint me. Cephalu. Nope. Cephalu. Cephalu. The first thing we see are these charming and evil lanes, and that. We are here, and today we're gonna do all of that. That giant mountain with all the fortifications on it was where the original city was like 2,500 years ago. It's been an important feature for two to 3,000 years. Esa Vespas. There's some records from the Carthaginians, I think, from like four or 500 BC talking about it. The town is still full of ancient remnants, like this medieval wash house. You know, I put an R in it. Wash house. <laughs> the Romans would wash their clothes here using this to really scrub them. And then they'd rinse them upstream to wash. And out to sea. The year round population is about 14,000. But they get tons of tourists. And it is easy to see why. There's an ancient walkway along the edge, but you can only take it when the seas are calm. The seas have been a bit rough the last couple days. Uh, we've actually been here, I don't know, about four or five days already, yeah. but haven't done any touring because of the weather. We finally got some good weather. What we have been doing, however, is experiencing the amazing local dining options. <laughs> like this. The Seafood Place comes highly recommended by our host. The father is the fishmonger from next door. We just ordered the fish of the day with vegetables. Look at this. And this. White Horse is another local favorite for pizza. They have a chart that is tr with all the ingredients that is translated in four languages. Thankfully, one of them is English. That stuff's amazing. Let's see. Let's 
Get the pizza. Come. I did a make my own margarita pizza with onions and ham. Uh, Italian pe pizzas take a little bit of work. You have to cut your own. Mm, I really love it. I bet this is easier. Pizzas are anywhere from seven to ten dollars. Ten euros. I got four cheese pizza with salami. There's a non-stop line of people coming for takeout. This is the specialty of the house, the white horse scacciata. It's like, I, I don't even know how to explain it. What would you say? I don't know, I want to peek at it. Got cheese and melted everything in it, and then they put it, another piece on top. It's like two pieces. Wow, this is amazing. They open at 7.15, so you better get here before eight or you're not finding a table. Holy shiata, Batman. That is absolutely amazing. <laughs> and this. Another recommendation from our host was pasta y pasta. It's all homemade, everything. Mushroom crepe. That's really good. It's decadent. I've never had anything like it. It was a thick porcini mushroom cream. It was amazing. And this. Lasagna al forno. Mm, that's really good. It's everything you want lasagna to be. I'm happy. And maybe a little bit of this. And gnocchi with speck ham and gorgonzola. I like gorgonzola, that is the gnocchi for you. This place is seven to 10 euros a plate. It's a great bargain. But now on to the walkway. And that's why you gotta come when the seas are low. What this kind of rock is called, but it's loaded with fossils. Yeah, maybe not today, the rest of it. <laughs> Check this out. That's where the path would have come up. Pass a little wit still. We'll try it in a couple days. This wall is from 1200 AD, and this wall is from 4 to 500 BC. That's old. It's old. Wow factor. We're going to try and hike up there tomorrow. Oh, wow. <laughs> you don't want to visit the UK. You've got to see what's out there. Katie, why are you squinting? Well, I grabbed my sunglasses, then I set them back down. <laughs> and also because of that. Well, that does look a bit ominous. Check out the caves up there. Wow. You can see the fortifications. I'd really like to go hike in those. Apparently, Chefalu knows how to party. It's fun to explore in a direction. You never know what you're going to come to. It looks like somebody's house. Well, since we're not guests, we should probably turn around. Change of plans. So, we came this way, and it was blocked by a hotel. None shall pass. Then we came this way, and it was blocked for road construction. But I must cross this bridge. Then you shall die. So now we're going back the other way. So you want to check out the famous UNESCO World Heritage Norman Church behind us? It's like a thousand years old. <laughs> Maybe after lunch. Of course we wound up back at Paste Pasti. It's everywhere in December.
charming streets of Chapaloo. Keep drinking this coffee. <laughs> Make the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>